today we're off to a place called Mary McIntosh Park. McIntosh. That's yeah. it. Scottish. I think she's related to you, John. Well, I'm half Scottish. John's done a ancestry. Stop wiggling the car. <laughs> John's done an ancestry.com thingy and it's come back that he's half Scottish. He really looks it, don't you reckon? Hey, yeah. But um, you don't wear a kilt. Well, only when you go out. But we won't go into that. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, we'll head off to Mary McIntosh Park. It's at a place called Widgee. Apparently there's a creek that flows through it, but um, anything like the last couple of places we've been, it's all dried up. Yeah, not much rain down this way. No. John. Yes. We're nearly there. Two kilometres to go. 2.5. All right, 2.5. So, nearly time to slow down. I'm only doing 80. Yeah, but last time you didn't slow down and you missed the shot. And there's cars behind us, I think. Okay, so, okay, well now, no, not now, but soon, they are two kilometres. Jeez, it's a bouncy road. Some are terrible, eh? Some are really good, terrible. Gee whiz. Okay, one kilometre. into this park anyhow let's just drive well, into that maybe park maybe this is just a maybe here. let's drive in there oh, and go and have a look it's mark mcintosh that's it this is it yeah so we must just park anywhere we want notice self-contained vehicles only maximum say three days so we must just drive over in this this grass area john are you allowed to drive over there yeah there must be no tent or spark camping All right, we're going to have a little look, but I think down there, where that... Oh, does it? But look down here. Because down there, even though it's right near the road, that would be so lovely to sit in, looking over the, at the bridge. We don't have a captain We come in here. This is Sunday lunchtime. So we've got the pick of the crop. It's pretty busy. Apparently cows and stuff come up here, but over here, I mean, it's on the road, but it doesn't look like it's a very busy road. We could either park here, but it would mean road noise. No, I'd rather where we are than here. Rather where we are, because you've got this, look. How nice we've got to go down there. Right on the river. Yeah, but I reckon, don't reckon people tow vans down there, John. Should be right. Oh, stop with you, she'll be right. Do any of you other ladies have husbands that just say that? She'll be right. It ain't happening. How nice we'll be under here. That's an old bridge. Can you go for a swim? Apparently people have been for a swim in there. Oh, heaps, I reckon. How would you get in and out though? It's down there. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll go back up the top now. Rip the rain up the top. This would be perfect here so you could have the picnic table and that. So toilets, I'll go and inspect those later. There's bins over so there. Oh, barbecues there. Oh, barbecues. Pick one. Yeah, no. Oh, there's a, a um, stone over here, John. A what? Like a plaque on a stone. That's a little bit about Mary McIntosh. Oh no, this bridge was named. Oh, this bridge bridge was named Inky McIntosh. Who? Inky. Inky. Oh, Ian Inky Donald McIntosh, a councillor for Kilkeven Shire Council. I thought you said stinky. No. All right, just testing out different areas. So you can park all along that fence. 
It is pretty level over there, I reckon. But even though this is right near the road, it just would be a lovely spot to sit out looking at that bridge. Dogs on leash, no trail bike riding, no horses, no littering, no fires except in pits provided. How nice would this be? Look, yeah. Like, we just put our chairs out here and the awning out and the bridge is there to look at. I think we've got a good position, even though it's right on the road. I can't imagine this road being really noisy over night time. To honour Charter member Marg McIntosh from the Quota Club of Gympie. So here the nearest dump point is in Gympie or Kilkeven and the nearest potable water is at Coomera Showgrounds or Archery Park in Gympie. It says you can go and visit um, places like Kilkeven and Coomera from here but well I wouldn't leave here for leaving the van today because we're the only person here, only people here. I knew I saw a sign, 72 hours, and after your 72 hours, you can't come back for 48 hours, and your water has to be contained. All right, I just checked out the toilets. They're clean, um, just normal park toilets. There's plenty of toilet paper. They're flushable. Someone is smoking wacky weed around here somewhere. It's quite strong, but anyhow, we'll go and see what John's doing. Someone's smelling, smoking wacky weed somewhere. There's no one around. It's coming from so. Can't you smell it? No. Oh. Alright, Johnny. What do you think about staying here? Like, are you happy? Yeah, I'll stay here. I like the other place better than we stayed. This is alright. Yeah, the other place was off the road. I mean, we can always look on Wiki Camps and find more if you want. Have a look if you want, but this is alright. Okay. Have a look and see what's there. Okay. Well. It's, the weather's turned and we're getting smashed. Well, it's, it's slowed down a bit now, but... Reality's a van life. Oh, I had to pack up quick. It was coming over the mountains and yeah, now it's crazy. It's wet out there. Yeah. Well, I couldn't believe it. I was walking back and I just looked over those mountains and you could just see it coming towards us, eh? Then our daughter found. She said, are you getting smashed by the rain? We're like, no, it's nice and sunny. What, 10 minutes after we hung up? Yeah. It's like this. So. That's right, nice and dry inside. Yeah, and book reading with the weather. I just wish we had a second Sirocco fan. Or aircon. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> a better battery, better system. battery system. So we can put the aircon on because it's bloody hot. Well, and it's... we've got 200 watts of lithium, so, you know, another couple of those and we can be able to run it in an inverter. Yeah. We can't have the big windows open because it's so windy. That the windows are sort of just lifting, aren't they? Yeah. So, yeah. So, the storm has passed, and the rivers, well, not that river, creek, we are going to call it, has come up just a little bit. Actually, quite a lot, actually. Oh, now that's going to come out. So peaceful down here. And this beautiful old bridge, just love old stuff like this. There we are up there. Yeah, that's nice. been a good couple of days. Oh yeah, just so peaceful out here. Get a bit of road noise from the road, but if you wanted to, you could park right up the back. But I like the spot we're in. So we've slept the night, um, had a fair bit of rain last night, but um, it was alright. John was asleep by 7.30 and I didn't get to sleep till later because every bloody noise just... You worried too much. <laughs> Anyhow, Marg McIntosh Park at Witchy. It was good. It was good. Check it, it out. Stay. Yeah. We had the place all to ourselves and it quite safe and great so there thanks for watching and we'll see you next time thanks guys